My role is primarily to uh, review applications for development from landowners and uh, we review all different kinds of projects that they'd like to do on their property and if it meets with our policies and meets with our legislation then we can issue them a permit for that development. Uh, within the Conservation Authorities Act there's a regulation that every Conservation Authority has and that uh, specifies where, uh, what features are regulated and if anybody is proposing development within that regulated area around those features that's when they need a permit from us. Uh, and those features are generally things like shorelines uh, adjacent to lakes or rivers and watercourses or steep slopes. So we're going to survey the flood elevation on this property to see how far up the water came during a flood because that will have implications on where somebody can do work along their shoreline. Now it's primarily um, a way for conservation authorities to manage different kinds of land use around specific hazards such as flooding and erosion, uh, dynamic beaches, and we're also concerned with issues surrounding pollution and conservation of land, uh, which is specifically for things like wetlands and other environmental features. Okay, anything that they do from this pink line down to the water, they still have to maintain the grade of everything that's there. So the, the grade of the land can't change, so you can't block any water, you can't stop water from coming up to at least this line.